here's a step-by-step -step guide to perform and record the briggs rauscher oscillating reaction safely in a lab. Materials required. 1. Hydrogen peroxide, 30% solution. 2. Potassium iodate, potassium hypoiodite. 3. Malonic acid, CH, COH. 4. Manganese sulfate, manganese 2 sulfate, as a catalyst. 5. Starch solution, used as an indicator. 6. Sulfuric acid, hydrogen sulfate, to maintain an acidic environment. 7. Distilled water, to dilute the solutions. 8. Beaker, at least 500 milliliters. 9. Magnetic stirrer, or manual stirring rod. 10. Safety goggles and gloves, for lab safety, procedure, prepare solutions. 1. Solution A. Dissolve 43 grams of potassium iodate, potassium hypoiodite, in 1 liter of distilled water. 2. Solution B. Dissolve 15 grams of malonic acid and 1.5 grams of manganese sulfate, manganese 2 sulfate, in 1 liter of distilled water. 2. Add 10 milliliters of starch solution to this mixture. 3. Solution C. Use 30 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide, 30%, diluted with 970 milliliters of distilled water. Set up. 1. Place a beaker on a magnetic stirrer, or prepare to stir manually. 2. Add 300 milliliters of solution A, potassium iodate, to the beaker. 3. Add 300 milliliters of solution B, malonic acid and starch, into the same beaker. 4. Start stirring gently. Start the reaction. 1. Add 300 milliliters of solution C, hydrogen peroxide, to the beaker while stirring. 1. Almost immediately, you should notice the solution begin to oscillate between clear, amber, and dark blue. Observe. 1. The reaction will cycle through the color changes for several minutes. 1. These color shifts are caused by the periodic formation and destruction of iodine and iodide species, driven by the interaction of the reactants. Record the reaction. 1. Use a camera to record the reaction as it occurs. 1. Ensure your setup allows for clear visibility of the color changes. 1. You might want to zoom in to capture the dynamic transitions more clearly. Safety Notes 1. Handle hydrogen peroxide and sulfuric acid with care, as both are highly corrosive. 2. Wear gloves, goggles, and a lab coat to protect yourself from splashes. 3. Perform the experiment in a well-ventilated area or under a fume hood. By following these steps, you can safely conduct and record the briggs rauscher reaction. The resulting video will show the beautiful oscillating color changes in real time.